hey guys. guys i'm dominique and i'm carlos and welcome back to two modern vegans happy thanksgiving merry christmas and happy new year <laughs> um i know we've been gone for some months but um so much so much has been going on in our personal lives so we're back now for the new year i hope that you've been following us on social media if you haven't you've seen that even though we haven't made a video, we posted up a couple of recipes on our web our website. We're excited to be back. Uh, we're gonna try to get new recipes out to you guys every week. Um, and if it's not a video, we'll at least put the recipe on our website. So be sure to follow us and subscribe to our website, tomodernvegans.com. So we did pick oh. our winner for our contest that we was having, our 1K giveaway. Um, and we're gonna post up on our social media more about that. Um, we're gonna announce the winner's name. So if you are following us on Facebook or Instagram, you'll definitely see that there. So we'll put more information there. Thank you guys so much because uh, on our last video, we had just reached to over a thousand subscribers and now we're over 2,000 subscribers and we haven't made a video in a while. So that's awesome. Um, thanks for the love. Thanks for the support. Um, yeah, we're going to continue bringing you amazing, delicious, comforting recipes. So today we are going to be making a vegan buttermilk pancake with blueberry compote and um, it's topped with crack butter. So it doesn't actually have crack in there. It's just addicting. But it's, yeah, it's very, very addicting. It's so good. Um, you guys are going to love it. You can put the cracked butter on pancakes. You can put it on biscuits. You can literally put it on anything. It tastes so good. It does. It's like having dessert pretty much, uh, which breakfast kind of is like dessert anyway. Uh, but it's so good. Um, like we literally had this two, three times during the week. Um, in a row. We, in a row because it was just that good. <laughs> I hope you guys love it as much as we do. All right, guys, let's get into this recipe. Here are the ingredients that you're going to need. All right, guys, so we're going to start out making our buttermilk. We're going to use 3 fourth cup of almond milk. and a tablespoon of apple cider vinegar. And you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and you're gonna mix that up and let that stand by itself so it can curdle up and become buttermilk. Next, in a large bowl, we're gonna add a cup of flour, a tablespoon of baking powder, and a big pinch of salt. And then we're gonna go back to our buttermilk and we're gonna add the remaining wet ingredients. Which are one tablespoon of avocado oil, three tablespoons of maple syrup, half a teaspoon of vanilla extract, and you're gonna wix that all together. Then you're gonna go ahead and you're gonna add that to your dry ingredients. And then you're gonna also whisk that all together. But if your mixture is too thick, this is where you're gonna add in the additional three tablespoons of almond milk. And it basically should look something like this. So we got this cute little pan to make pancakes for our son. And we decided to use it for this video. And you're gonna add in the pancake mixture one fourth cup at a time for each pancake. It should make about seven pancakes. And when it starts to bubble on top, that's when you know it's time for you to flip it. And it basically should look something like this. So we're gonna put that to the side and we're gonna work on the remaining ingredients. So we're gonna add one fourth cup of brown sugar, 
a half a cup of vegan butter, and a fourth of a teaspoon of ground cinnamon. Then you're gonna go in with your hand mixer and you're gonna mix that all up. And of course it's gonna be too soft, but you can place it in the refrigerator for it to firm up a bit. For our compote, we're gonna add in a cup of blueberries at first, and then 1 fourth cup of cane sugar, two teaspoons of lemon juice, and three tablespoons of water. And you're gonna mix this up and you're gonna let that cook down for about 10 minutes. And it basically should look something like this. It's gonna start to thicken and then you're gonna add in the remaining one cup of blueberries and then you're gonna let that cook down for an additional eight minutes. And if it becomes too thick, you can always add a tablespoon of water at a time to loosen it up, but the choice is totally up to you. And that's really it, it's pretty simple, you guys. It basically should look something like this. So we're gonna just make our plate. We placed our blueberry compote on our pancakes, top that with our crack butter, and of course we went in with maple syrup because you definitely should only be eating pancakes with maple syrup, you guys. Only maple syrup. We hope that you all enjoyed this video, and more importantly, we hope that you enjoyed these pancakes. Um, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already. Also, make sure that you're following us on social media, on Instagram and Facebook, and also subscribe to our mailing list on our website so you can continue to be updated with all our new recipes and videos to come in the future. Bye. Bye.